What does it take to get All India Rank 1 and was it worth it? I mean, did you not feel burned out during your preparation or? I did feel burned out then. How were you consistent and what would you tell a normal person? Like, do you think it's actually possible for someone to crack J mains in like three months? What are those couple of things that you'd like to suggest them? So, first things first, like, uh, I think IITJ is coming up in like next three months, J mains. So, most of the people were asking questions like, See, I, I don't know anything right now. I did not prepare much. If I start right now, how much can I actually score in JU mains? Will I be able to crack it? If I have to crack it, what is the strategy that I should follow? What are some of the best books to follow? You don't need to say, ah, yeah, it's, it's easy. Yeah, it's obviously not easy. I know it's not easy, but uh, it depends on how much like actually motivated you are. And if you are ready to spend 15, 16 hours grinding, you could probably get like a score of 180 to 200. If you start from the bare basics and the uh, people who have uh, more experience like who are actually studying should be able to do more okay don't neglect chemistry you can solve the whole chemistry paper if you know everything in 20 minutes except maybe the calculation part you can answer everything in 20 minutes it's basically three marks even if it's hard for you to buy hard try it will probably be more worth it than solving a math question which can take around three to five minutes easily it's a bit lengthy makes sense and uh, if you are like starting just now or don't have a lot of confidence, please do NCRT and previous main questions. You should be confident that you can get like 70% in the main paper because they can't ask a very wild different paper for you. They are going to ask something similar to the previous year questions. Mm. So you can expect like 60 to 70% of the things will be somehow related to the previous year questions. Even the previous five years questions, I would say. So if you are able to like properly solve it, that should be a good step. And also focus on more important topics, which are higher weightage first, then focus on the less important topics. Yeah. So next thing, like a lot of them are like addicted to their phones. They're like scrolling reels and all that stuff. So if I am that person, like very addicted, I just wake up, use my phone every day. Uh, and then I study for 20 minutes, scroll reels for one more hour. Then I come back, sit in the class, maybe sit in the last bench and then use my phone over there, come back who again starts scrolling dreams on my phone. So what would you like to suggest me? First of all, don't take your phone to class. However worse it is, just don't. Next thing is maybe if you have parents near you, ask them to like uh, give printouts to stuff and rather than you trying to use your phone for something. Unless you want to use listen to online lectures. If possible, try to use a laptop because it's harder to get addicted to reels in the laptop. Yeah. Makes sense. Have you ever not, I mean, uh, you must have been going through it right now also because again, the research and everything is like very hectic uh, and you must have prepared for JAE also for a considerably larger amount of time. Did you not feel burned out during your preparation or don't you feel burned out right now? And if you, if yes, like how do you overcome it? Generally, the thing is like uh, making sure not to like feel very sad if you're burned out first of all. Don't lose the motivation when whenever you're not getting good marks or just it's too tiring for you because maybe two, three weeks you're able to like do a lot of hard work and you're just tired of all that. The main things you can do is try to keep a decent amount of sleep. Mm -hmm. If you feel burned out, maybe just sleep at that time and uh, try to exercise. Exercising really helps for your mood. It helps mm -hmm. to like make your mood positive. Don't eat uh, junk food. No junk food. Basically, you'll have to set your sleep food and also a bit of lifestyle makes sense like uh, for this entire study transformation cohort we have like an entire chapter dedicated to the sleep food and lifestyle thing because even I felt it is like very very important but not a lot of teachers talk about it like it's basically because even those teachers might not even know like what it takes to you know be yeah, a student yeah. and be in the preparation this is like a funny question okay what does it take to get all India rank 1 and was it worth it? Getting all India rank 1 is better than getting anywhere between 2 to 50 2 to 50 is like one Bracket and all India rank one is like a separate bracket. Yeah. In that sense, yes, it's really worth it. But uh, you can't expect to get all India rank one. That's just you need luck in your side in the exam. And many times trying to get like anywhere in the top 300 all India rank is actually a good thing. You cut off to the top IITs, computer science. Mm -hmm. And other than that, there's a good the way how the recruiters see you in this bracket and that bracket. That is like a good goal to keep. Also, I had a lot of time. I had five, six years of just studying for G 11th and 12th syllabus. If you are a smart student, then you can do it in two years. But yeah, it's going to take a lot of hard work. It might drain you alive. How did you feel after giving JE? I didn't care if I get first. I didn't I didn't think of getting first. That's the what I mean. And I was not honestly expecting first. As I was probably not even getting the best in my Narayan itself. It's not like I was the best. I was probably like top three fourths. So I was just like, I just need to write well enough that I go to IIT Bombay. If not, it's not a bad line anyways.
It's not Got like it. I can't change my life from a top to hundred to a good ends, whatever I want to do later. If someone has like almost two years to prepare, maybe one and a half year to prepare, you said they can easily target for like somewhere around top five hundred, three hundred, five hundred, something like that. What else do they have to focus on? What if they actually have like a lot of time? If you can enroll in coaching, enroll in coaching. If you have the money to do that, please do. Please focus on NCRT because even in general ones, like because you're smart, you can apply things which you get you learn from NCRT. With enough practice, probably 50 to 60 percent you can see direct applications of NCRT, but using a bit more of brain. Instead of remembering a lot of things, you just use logic yeah. to decode a couple you of just questions. Use logic and in sometimes intuition experience. If I'm not wrong, 60 percent is nearly 500 cutoff. Yeah. So if you're smart, you can do that. If you, you probably will be able to make out a little bit more time. So NCRT previous year, and then you can go to the next type of books. Physics Galaxy for Physics. Maths, you can solve any other maths resource. Chemistry, unless it's physical chemistry, I wouldn't recommend to do anything else. Just focus more on math and physics. For maths, probably the main thing you would have to do is improve your calculations. Actually. Like me, perhaps like I could maybe think three steps ahead, which you might have to think do it in paper. I could maybe think it in my mind and think it. This method, this thing might not work. This thing, oh, this might come close to answer. Let's try this. So I might, when you put it on a paper, I might have a better chance of getting the answers when I try my method. Because in my mind, possibilities are going on. This is actually like playing chess. I and mean, when you play a lot of chess, you can actually decode like the next 15, 16 moves, right? In advance. Yes, yes. So I think like what you're trying to say is when you solve a lot of questions of maths or whatever the subject it is, yeah. and you can actually just look at the question and be like, oh, bro, this one step, this, 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 this. And you, yeah. you actually need to write an idea of roughly how to do. So you can be like, maybe this is how you were supposed to do two, three steps from the front and back. So then you just have to fill the middle steps and you get your solution fast. So basically the pattern recognition uh, and yeah. questions. Got it.